All right, guys, hope you're all doing well. Today's video is for the DIY enthusiast who love to brick lay. And today we're gonna to build something simple. Everyone can follow along, anyone can do this. Because today, we're gonna to build a brick barbecue. Just like this one, dead simple, dead easy. If you follow along, you'll be able to do it no problem. So without further ado, let's get stuck into the video. Hope you enjoy. So we've got our bricks here, motorboard there. And the tools you're gonna to need for the job are a spirit level, the travel, simple. This is a jointer, this is a different kind of a jointer. Tape measure, pencil, and I've got some metal brackets instead of, we're gonna do it a little bit different. And I think it'll be a bit more easier when the way we do it here. And instead of turning some bricks sideways to create the different levels for the grills, we're just gonna put some brackets in. I've got training mortar, but you really wanna mix some sand and cement, and you want to put four sand in, and one cement, so just gauge it that way, four to one. I've got a mixing video if you want to look on the channel. This is the grill, it comes with a template, so we're just gonna work off this template. This is the inside internal size, so our bricks go around the perimeter of this template. So what we can do is just mark it with a pencil, this is where we're gonna go. You are gonna to have to make some kind of footing if you put it on grass. Just dig a patch of grass out, and then put a bit of concrete in about 150 mil worth of concrete because it's not it's not going to be really heavy so it's not going to sink or bed it on some flags keep your template firm in place this cardboard's been cut at perfect 90 degree corners angles so you don't need to worry about that using a square or anything like that they do that for you so that's bobby dazzling we'll mark that out right there like so put it dry bond the 10 mil joint we want, and we'll just chase this bond round, setting them out dry. Put our grill in place. That's where she's going to go, isn't it? So I'll just place everything out dry, gives you an idea of where things are going to go, doesn't it? And then what we'll do is we'll lay our bricks to that line. So, that's where our face is going to go along this line, okay? Right, now my mortar is, is a reddish colour because it's just got lime in it for training purposes. Just spread your mortar there and throw your bed. Now, Right, now I'm going to place the first brick in here. This is it. Right. We'll start with a nice 10mm joint. You can hit your level because it's got a rubber part on the end of your travel. Don't hit it with the metal part, but yeah. Just tap it down gently until the bubble's in the middle. Look that. Last couple of brick. Tidy and out, spread through here. Okay, just the back control. Try and get a nice uniform bed. Scrape off any excess. Okay. Just gently tap that, holding your back brick in case you don't want to push it out soon. Push into place. It's nice to pull your joint. Scrape off any excess. Back on the board. So it again. So 
or just a little touch and then that, that's it. That's what we're looking for every time. This, right in the middle. Alright, so that's our last one. Bob it into place. Yeah. Looks better. Now we know that's touching. Alrighty then. So I've also got these as well, folks. These are just wall ties and I've just bent them round, so that's another good way of just holding them on. So that could be for another course of grill. Just like so. Just bed them on like that so they can't come out and there you go. And they're, they're nice and safe because there's no, no sharp edges. Like a pair of scissors really, isn't it? On turquoise as well. No rude jokes, come on, it's a family show. Yeah. <laughs> We're up seven courses and after the next course, the eighth, we are going to put the ties on which are going to hold the grill in place. Alright then, guys, so now we're going to take our wall ties and this is the course that we're going to bed them on with just a little bit of overlap so that our grill can rest on there, see? Now we're going to take our wall ties and place them in on the left side. So just put our bed down first. I'm going to spread the dry and then just push that in. Not going on that joint, that's right. When you want, I'll tell you, right, that's 30 mil and that, that should be that should be fine. Again on this joint here at the front, matching up with that, we've got 30 mil. Now make sure you push them right down to the top of the brick because then we'll know the level with each other. And you just place your brick on top of that bed. And you carry on as you would, you know? Just cutting in the excess off. On the joint in the middle with 30 mil all round. But I disagree. I wake up in the magic. Someday soon I'm gonna make it. What we're 
we can do now is try our grill. There we go. That's fun dabby doors there. We've got our bed and mortar on again and we are just going to go on top of the ones underneath, basically. Again with 30 mil. Alright, so we've got our last two bricks going in because <laughs> we've no more bricks left. <laughs> Simply. There we go. Just gonna level them in place. If you want to find out how to finish brickwork, I'm going to do more videos like this on the channel, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next one.